Hi, I'm Gordon Dugan, physical therapist at the Orthopedic Institute of Western Kentucky. Today we're going to talk about phase two ACL rehabilitation. If you didn't get to check out our phase one exercises, be sure to watch those in the previous video. Uh, today in phase two is four to six weeks. The goals for phase two is normalizing gait. We want the patient to be able to walk pretty much normal or level surfaces, uh, continue to decrease swelling, and then continue to increase quad strength. This exercise is called a wall ball squat. Here the patient has the ball just above the glutes. He's gonna go down, pushing through his heels to about 90 degrees, and then push back up and squeeze the glutes at the top. Here we're doing a step up and then step down on the up uh, stroke. He is using his glutes and quad, squeezing at the top, and then he's controlling the descent like he would be walking downstairs. This exercise is a lateral step down. Here what we're looking for is to sit back on the heel, making sure the knee doesn't come too far forward, and then stabilizing the hip and not dipping. This exercise is a BOSU squat with the medicine ball. Uh, basically we're having the patient sit back on the heels, controlling down, and then as he comes up right there, squeezing the glutes. Uh, what we're looking for here is not to come towards the midline. This exercise is a sidestep with a T-band. We have the band around the athlete's ankle. He is uh, pushing out to the left and then controlling with the right hip. As you can see here, we want the hip fully extended and then the side of the hip. This is your basic upright bike. Once the uh, patient has sufficient uh, knee bend, we can put him on the bike uh, for range of motion and also to help with some endurance. Those are our phase two exercises. Now we move on to phase three, which is six to 12 weeks. Be sure to uh, watch the upcoming videos on our OIWK YouTube channel.